Hello viewers. In the previous video, we showed that how to make a notification system. So in this case, we are just going to uh, just rearrange these things uh, and just, uh, make our notification more visible to the users. All right. So if we refresh this page, oh, no poster here. All right. So we can see there is a chain notification that, that is showed here because in our database we can see there is chain notifications. So and uh, if uh, you you if you see that there is a read and column, so it will be measured that if a notification is read or not. Okay. So in this case it is all one, so it uh, it shows that it is not read. So we need to get uh, get these things done, so so the users can make this notification as read. Okay, and also get uh, rid of these uh, three numbers uh, of when the no there is no notification. Okay, so at first do that. Let's do this uh, three thing, uh, three count three here. Okay, so uh, where is it? We code it here. Okay, so equal count is equals here, and and then as I said. Uh, we need to get this read end column because if we just uh, need to get this get notifications of that that is not read so we need to put that where the read end is one okay so if we just put some yeah put the one so if we go to a page and refresh so this is not changed so because why because because there is a three uh, this three notification has one so if we change uh, one of them is zero so if we refresh this page and we can see this is two okay so we got we have got this data okay so uh, we just uh, make the notification read so our notification is down to two so uh, now what we, we we need to do that uh, if no uh, all the notification is read then it will be there will be no count show here okay so let's do this so to do that we are just get rid of this echo first time we're just making a check here uh, so before check let's put this get rid of this okay so now if we uh, let's make a check here just if our count is greater than zero then we echo and uh, then we print our notifications okay so then this time uh, just put some um, okay so this thing here just a bracket for decoration okay so count so count dot and here okay so if we go there in our page refresh nothing has changed so we are putting the wrong bracket here right my bad okay okay so now if we change all of our the notifications as read so just make them zero this is the one this is the another one if we refresh that no number has been shown here okay so that's great so uh, we just to make them uh, one, uh, this two one because we need to get the work done here. Okay. So what's our next step? Our next step uh, is if we refresh this. Okay, so two here and there. Okay. So our next step is if we are going to show that our notification is read or not. Okay. So in this case, uh, we need to get all of our notifications. I think. Uh, this is the row count okay so yeah uh, at first we need to get these things as before as that because why because we need to get all of our notifications okay so we have get our three notifications and we have count here for, for the another query I am going to explain uh, explain this. Just uh, make this code here. Video query select uh, select 
star from notification where read n is equals one. Okay, just put that one. Okay. So in this case, we are just uh, this will be the uh, we just create a new data. Put that new here. Okay. So in this case, if we refresh our page, then we can see two. So what well, I have done here that we uh, just get all of our notifications at first. So we can uh, see the list of whole notification here. Okay, and our count will be counted as uh, as that our notification is read or not. So if we have got uh, we have get our that notification that is not read. So there in this case this is two notification are not read. Okay, so then we have get this two but get all of our notifications. Okay, so at this stage we just decorate these two because these two notification is not read to decorate these two notifications as uh, read okay so what uh, what should we do to do that so to do that we need to grab this data okay uh, not this or uh, this data will be fine. Okay, so if we uh, at first that we just echo out our title of our notifications Okay, so there is the notification is here. So there will be need some conditions to fulfill this so if we uh, Just copy it and make some code here PHP So in this case, we have got all of our data. So we just check that I uh, check our read n table. Okay. So how we can do that? So we just make condition if our value is what is that? The read n. Read n. We just check our read n value. Read n is equals one. And then we need to do something then then what we need to do then we just break our PHP tag here and break this here okay and we just copy this line and paste it okay and this case we just put in some class here that is called that uh, alert uh, this is a bootstrap class alert uh, just what is a warning will be fine i think warning yep okay so what i have done here that if our value uh, if our read n is marked as one okay so then we put our uh, to put our tone notification as some decorated with colors okay so there in this case it will be just a warning sign it will be i think it will be red or something okay so if if this uh, notification is not read so it will be turned red and else else uh, it is uh, if it is uh, read already so then what we do so we just uh, put this right here and just paste it here as usual okay so let's see what's happening okay so refresh that yep we as you can see there's these two notification is colored as uh, you know some reddish type things uh, I think that will be fine okay so if we are going to be if we are going to change this notification as one uh, it will be not read and this will be read so it will be more clear for to you <coughs> so refresh this reload this and then we can see this this two notification is color marked as in a color so uh, let's make this color as red so because it is not catching in your eye so alert will be dangerous if i think so reload that yep now this is now okay <coughs> all right so we have just decorated it so this is great our notification system is done great so what we need to do now 